Good morning. Uh, my name is Josh Hamilton, and I am an applicant for Lamar University's Principal Certification Program. Uh, and these are my answers to the video questions. So uh, let's begin. So question number one, uh, I'm actually looking to pursue my principal certification for a few reasons. Um, first, I already have my master's in secondary education, and I'm currently working on a doctorate in literacy and language. However, I've learned over the last five years of my public school experience teaching high school speech and debate that leadership is probably the most important thing aside from student development within a public school system. So as I continue on this journey in education, I know that I need to continue to build my education strategies and I feel like moving towards a principal certification is the best way to go because primarily I believe that I'm a leader and I know that if I want to be the lead horse or the lead dog or whatever saying you want to add to it, then the principal certification is the best way to move in this particular field. People have asked me all the time, Josh, why are you not going to pursue you know, faculty or something like that once you have your PhD? Which I think is a fair question. The reality is, is as I continue along my educational journey, I know that what's best and what's in my heart is working with middle school and high school students and furthermore helping develop staff to better those children. So I probably will never be a faculty member maybe later in life uh, once my PhD is complete, but I know that the principal certification is the best route for me currently because my old high school principal once told me, Josh, one day you'll be a high school principal, and I think she was right. My uh, philosophy of leadership is actually pretty intricate. When it comes to a philosophy of leadership, the first thing that I believe in is building better rapport. And by that, I mean it's pretty simple. When you build a good rapport, a good relationship with the people that you are in charge of or whatever the actual strategy may be in terms of you know getting to know them, interpersonal communication, one-on-ones, for me, my leadership philosophy always comes back to that building meaning, meaningful relationships component because with a meaningful relationship, you one, get to know people better, and two, when people know you better, they know your genuine heart and your interest and where they lie. So as a leader, I would one, get to know people on the faculty, staff, or whatever the leadership role may be. And then second, it's all about trusting in your employees. If you hire the right people, you'll never really have to worry about are they getting the job done right. And I think that's really important too, is to, to trust your employees and let them do their job. What I bring to the program uh, is actually pretty unique because I already have the master's and this is just a certification and I'm already working on a PhD in literacy and language, um, I have a vast array of knowledge in terms of public schools and education. First, for my secondary degree, uh, or my master's degree in secondary education, uh, I learned about public school policy, I learned about different practices, best practices in teaching, uh, things of that nature. Also, my literacy and language program as of now, I've learned a lot about curriculum development curriculum development as well as like fundamentals of reading and those types of components with early childhood education. So I think I bring a vast variety of educational components and then in terms of experience I've been a speech and debate teacher for the past five years so I bring classroom experience to the table as well and working with various administrators. I hope to learn in this program uh, more about like the fundamentals in building a school if you will not you know from the ground up with your hands but I hope to learn more about like public policy, community engagement, um, standardized testing, how to do scores and budgets, uh, the leadership components that really come into play with being a principal or an assistant principal. Um, I feel really good about discipline, interpersonal communication, day-to-day uh, -day tasks that I see a lot of principals doing, but in terms of like budget, structure, scheduling, uh, public school policies, that's what I really hope to gain out of this certification program. Uh, and then finally, in five years, I really hope to be an either assistant principal or at that point, hopefully a principal, uh, because I really feel like my heart is calling me to continue in public school education, specifically at the middle or high school level. And so in the next five years, my goal is to have my doctoral work complete, my principal certification in hand, and to either be an assistant principal role already or in a leadership role, hopefully as a principal of a school. So I look forward to being at Lamar University and working on my principal certification. And um, it's with humble gratitude that I ask that you all consider me for admission into your program.